um, blind side. I am dancing on the broken glass. Um, now you guys have kind of haven't been around in a couple of years, right? This is your first tour in the U.S. in what was it, like three years, I think. Yeah, two years since two we years. were here last time. So. Yeah, it's been a while. We felt we um, had to. Um, we've been here so much before, and we just felt that it was kind of like. We, were, we had to find inspiration somewhere else too, and uh, so we decided to go to other places in the world, South Africa, Europe, um, Australia, Asia. We kind of just wanted to see that, and also we wanted to be home for a little bit longer with our families, because we'd been here all the time for a long time. So. Yeah. Now we're excited to be back. Yeah, and with families, you just had a new addition, is that correct? I did, yeah. So how's that right. been? Uh, it's it's awesome. What can I say? <laughs> <laughs> so, was it a girl or boy? It's a little girl. Okay. Yeah. And what was the name? Was... Tindra. Tindra? So, yeah. Okay. So, is it is it tough being back on tour? Oh yeah, definitely. Since she's only two weeks old, and oh, wow. so, but it's a short tour, so we'll be home pretty soon. Um, that's and that's the reason why it's short. So. Okay. So, um, what are some things that you guys are looking forward to being back in the U.S.? Well, I, mean, like, I think there's, I mean, the, the, the one thing I look forward to most is to meet all the, our old friends. Since we've been playing here so much, uh, we've, we have a lot of connections here that are uh, kind of hard to keep up with, you know, to keep in contact with when you're in Sweden. So it's been, uh, that's what I'm looking forward to the most, to meet all those people. Uh, I think also we've, you know, this is where we built our fan base mostly you know we came back here more we played more here than we did in sweden and and i mean like we've gotten a lot of love from from the states so we're really excited to you know come back now we have a new ep out and you know we're excited to come back and just yeah be with friends you know in the crowd and on the side so it's cool And now your new EP is a di like a digital EP, is that right? It is, but it's also a printed one okay. that we brought on tour, but it's it's not available in the stores here. Uh, so it's only available online. Uh, it's just like a marketing issue? And, and here tonight, yeah. Okay, so it's like a marketing issue that it wasn't able to get in stores? Or? Uh, no, it's a choice, actually. Uh, we just wanted to try and see how that would work, you know? Um, there's... Uh, there's a way right now where, where uh, we think the CD is it's on the way out, you know. Yeah. Record stores are closing down, and there's a way for us to just uh, maybe try out that way. And, and it's a way for, for kids to support us right away, and there's no middle hands like, mm -hmm. in between the kids and us. So whoever wants to buy it, they, they know that they're supporting us. You know, it's not getting their money is not getting in the hand of any like, big record label or anything like that so. Okay. Cool. so um so with the whole like downloading thing like what are you guys like what are your opinions about the music downloading stuff on the internet and i mean we're we don't really care seriously <laughs> it's uh people can do what they want you know and uh, uh if they don't have money to buy our cd fine just download it for free it's fine but maybe you can support us by buying a shirt instead or, you know, um, yeah, come to the show or, you know, download it from our homepage if you want to support us. But, I mean, we don't want to put guilt on anyone for, for downloading. So, I mean, it's, we're fine with it. Because <laughs> okay. then there are some bands that are like, man, like, we got to eat somehow. And, like, I wasn't like, you know, there's a lot of bands. Yeah, we used to be like that. But, uh, <laughs> but then you just, I mean, it's a... That's the way it's gonna go anyway. Uh, it, it doesn't matter if you try to fight it, you know. With that, this, you know, that's the way it's gonna be in the future. And I think in in five, ten years, we're not gonna have this discussion anymore because yeah. everyone's gonna be downloading it for free. So we'll see what where we so, are at that well, time. Hopefully you know? not for free. <laughs> yeah. Maybe they'll start but, find some way to charge, like do the more iTunes. Yeah, stuff and I would think else. we as musician we will adapt. 
and the music business will adapt somehow. They, it's going to be probably a, a hard transition for for us and for because we, as you said, we got to eat somehow, and uh, <laughs> that's where the money's been coming in. But I mean, I think it has to adapt somehow. So.